How's it going everyone? Still Scissor here. We'll try this again. My OBS crashed last time I tried to record, so we are back where we left off um, in, I believe, Tranquilo Town. Um, and we just... Um, oh, it's getting a little brighter. It was so dark. I mean, it still is rather dark, but as you can see when we go in here, um, it's not... It's just how the game is, I guess. But we need to buy Pokeballs before we go anywhere. Can we buy... We can. Okay, so we can buy Pokeballs. Let's buy 10. But, oh, we can only buy nine. Oh, do I have to change? Oh, okay, that's a little weird. Anyway, nine's enough, I guess. We ha we have a potion, I think, so we should be good there. And we'll move on. I believe we're supposed to check out Trad Farm. Does this tell us? Okay, so Trad Farm is up north. I believe that's where it wants us to go. So let's go check that out. I heard some gatehouses have shops in them, so I came here. Not this one, it seems. Alrighty. I love movies. When I grow up, I'm gonna be... Wait. I'm gonna be a movie, or be in a movie? Hmm. North of here is Trad Farm. Beyond that is, well, mostly water, I think. So is it like a... Beach? Oh. There's a uh, Cutie Fly and Rabombi. Press the Z key to speed up battles. If you find yourself wanting to speed up a battle, press Z to speed it up or, Z or to slow it down again. Huh. Okay. When two trainers lock eyes, we must battle. We can try that out. We'll test out the uh, the speed up, I guess it's speed up button. That's what I'm gonna call it. Youngster Oliver would like to battle. Sends out a Sentret. So if I press Z, Z times three. Let's try just times two. Well, Ember this thing. Oh my. Oh, I thought it one shot it. Let's change it back to times one. I don't, it's kind of like skips. It just like skips frames. It doesn't really speed it up. Well, Ember this thing. I'm fine with times one. Sand attack. That's going to be annoying. Um, oh, we hit our ember anyway, so it don't really matter. So we beat this guy. I believe this was our first trainer battle. I don't think we battled a trainer yet. We do get to level 7. wonder if he'll learn any new moves that he doesn't normally get in this game. I really just have no idea anything about this game. I don't know the storyline basis or what, but we're going to find out. This here silo is for storing grain. Don't go playing in it, you hear it? Well, pfft. Oh, I thought it would let me up. It doesn't let me up. That's lame. Alright, so it does look like we can find some Pokemon here. Maybe something new other than Sentrant and Pidgey? A lily pup. Okay. I don't really want a lily pup. Not gonna lie. It's pretty similar to Growlithe. In design, anyway. So we're just gonna ember this thing. That's probably gonna do quite a bit, yeah. Stab tackle from a lily pup. What level is he? Three. Well, knocked out the lily pup. I believe that trainer is going to want to battle. What about you? Do you battle? You do. All right. Well, mom says slow and steady wins the race. It depends what kind of race. Preschooler Lisa would like to battle. A slow poke. I mean, we do have tackle, I guess, but this is going to take forever. Goes for the yawn. It's going to take even longer. <laughs> Go for the tackle again. Goes for the curse. Well, we're gonna go to sleep. Yes, yes, yes. All right, so now we're asleep. Can we wake up? No, we cannot. Goes for the curse again. So he's raising his attack and defense. I think at this point, Ember's gonna do more even if it's not very effective, just because he's plus two. So let's go for the Ember and we're still asleep. Do you have water gun? Because that's going to destroy us. Oh my gosh. Okay, well we can live one more. No! Alright, so... I, I guess I have to potion here. I'm pretty sure we have... Okay, we do have a potion. Choose crypto. Heal him up. He's going to tackle again. Please don't crit. Alright, he doesn't crit. Go for the ember. We wake up. This, I don't think this is going to kill though. 
Oh, it doesn't. Goes for the yawn again, which is actually probably best case scenario because we aren't missing an ember. And we won't have enough turns to go, go to sleep, so that's always nice. Alright, so let's go check out what's in this house. Oh, dearie me. Your Pokemon look pooped. Why don't you rest them? Oh, she just heals our Pokemon. Okay. I'm down with that. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, what do you have to say? Good golly, ain't nothing like a glass of Moss Sweet Homestyle Lemonade. You want some? Nah, I'm good. Might cost me something. Um, I think that kid's gonna want a battle. Let's go check out what's over here. I want to see if we can find... Ooh, a cutie fly. <sighs> I don't really care for cutie fly, if I'm being honest. I know I'm being picky right now. I should just catch something. But, whatever. One shot that thing. We should level up to level 8. Pretty awesome there. Now... Oh, you don't want to battle? Some say there's some sort of cavern under under this here farm. I just wonder how they would even know. But this guy's definitely going to want to battle, right? Yeah. Maybe there's different Pokemon in, like, the farm areas. Farm grass, or whatever you want to call it. Camper Ted. What you got? A mill tank. That is crazy. Are we a bite now? Honestly, I think he's going to have thick fat. We're going to go for the bite. I didn't even see that we learned bite. Where did that come from? That's going to hurt. Oh, nice and five damage. Can you get a flinch? Nope. And he's going to lower our attack. I'm going to go for the ember. Now that our attack's lowered. Even if he does have the thick fat. I'm not sure what other... Oh, killed him anyway. At, yeah, that I knew was going to give us a bunch of experience. We do level up off of that, level 9. Let's see what's in this grass. Why did it turn off my run? That's weird. It turned off my run. I thought the run was like automatic. We're just going to run from this thing. Like the... Can... Oh, can you not run in this grass? You might not be able to run in the grass. I don't think you can. We're just going to stand here and let this guy run into us. I can barely see in this maze. Oh, it's corn. Preschooler Zach has a Talo. I think that's the first Talo we've seen. That's an interesting sprite for Talo. Let's go for the Ember. This should really just knock it out. It's only level 3. Bop! Well, that was the easiest battle of my life. I want to encounter one more time in the corn. A Spinarak. Man. These Pokemon are kind of booty. I guess I'll catch the next cutie fly we see just for the heck of it. Alright, now I can turn on my run. Just to have something else, but I don't plan on using it. I don't want a normal type. Um, the only really good moves it's going to get are, I mean, normal type moves and dark type moves, and Growlithe already has Bite, so I don't really see us using it. Let's, think, let's battle this guy. If we need to, we'll go back and heal up. And then we can... Uh, I guess there's some corn up here. We can walk through it. Maybe there's different encounters in some of it. I feel like there needs to be a rare encounter. Maybe you can get Miltank up here. Not that I really want a Miltank either. But this will definitely knock out this Badoo. I mean, if they're using Miltanks and Badoos, I feel like we can catch on those. A Badoo would be pretty cool. I'd be down for a Badoo. A Wurmple. I do not want a Wurmple. Not really at all. Wurmple goes down. Crypto can't learn more than Odor Sleuth. No thank you. Alright. I'm not going to worry about healing up. Even though I'm sure we're going to encounter... Oh wait, there's an item up here. Let's go get this item. Something other than a lily pup. Ugh. Get out of here. I don't want you, Lily Pup. Leave me alone. There's an item over here. Can we run across the top? No, we can't. Okay. Well, we found a potion. I want to get... I just feel weird only having one Pokemon in this stage in the game. I know we aren't, like, super far in, but... I don't want to solo run this thing. Maybe we can go down the well? Let's check to see if we can go down the well. Maybe we can get something 
different down there. Maybe a rock type or something? Can we go down the well? Sounds echo ominously out of this well. I think we're going to be able to go down there. Let's check out the barn. There's a bunch of mill tank. Oh, there's someone in here. It would take some kind of genius to find me here, right under their noses. Is he... Who's he hiding from? I don't remember us looking... Can we fall down a cobweb? Maybe we can just fall down. Gah, get away from me. I didn't do anything wrong. You got that? Oh wait, you're just a kid. Okay, don't scream or nothing. How'd you find me up here? It's a cunning hiding spot. You're daring, huh? Hey, how about you and I make a deal? Mutually beneficial, I promise. I'm skipping town. I'm a free spirit, you know? Going with the wind. Not that I was here for very long, but just the same. I'm out. So really, why are you trying to lock me up? Why try and lock me up? I'm out of your hair regardless. The, the morality is a moot point, you dig? What, you want me off the streets? I didn't hurt anybody. Maybe I should pay a fine, right? Oh, this is the the guy from last episode. Okay. It's been a few days since I played, so I <laughs> didn't quite remember what happened. So how's about I pay a fine to you? Picking up what I'm putting down? One nugget, free of charge. Sell that for a pretty penny, huh? I give you this, and you don't have to tell anyone you saw me. I'll leave dusty old tranquil town, and everyone's better for it. And honestly, what do you owe these people, huh? Your neighbors? Just one little lie, and you get a fabulous parting gift. And understand, if you don't take it, and you try to cuff me, I'm not giving up easy. Picking up what I'm putting down? Choice and consequence. Your choices matter. Choose carefully when making decisions, as they may impact the outcome of your quest. What? I mean, we gotta go the good, good guy route, right? After all that simpering I did, you still don't want to help me. What a waste. Fine, I'll bow to you. Yeah, let's see about that. Hiya! All right, well. Here goes nothing. He looks nervous. Oh, we got bite for this thing. <sighs> let's go for the bite. Man, this, this battle would be tough if you chose Petalo. Depending on his second Pokemon. Oh, man. If you chose Petalo, I guess you might have a fairy move. Fairy wind or something. Detect. Okay. Fine with me. Catch this ember. I don't think it's going to one-shot, but... Yeah. Oh, that was a crit, too. Hello? That did eight damage. Holy cow. So this is... This is yeah, it didn't kill. See, we aren't even on two times speed, and it still feels like it's skipping frames. But, it, like I said in the last episode, it is a beta, so just keep that in mind. Alright, well, we defeated that guy. I would have gotten away with it. Got a thousand bucks for winning. Oh, I can't believe it. My daring escape, foiled by a teenager. What a world. I've never been much of a trainer, but this is still really embarrassing. Sigh, I have no way of resisting, so I guess I'll come quietly or whatever. Steel, it seems we had the same idea to search here, but you captured the fraud. Truly, I am very impressed. Hello, sir. A pleasure to see you again. Wasn't she the one who told us to come here? Steel, I am going to bring this man to the authorities. I still need to speak with you, however. Can we meet at the Pokemon Center? If you're not yet aware, it is the large red building in Tranquilo. Right this way, sir. Well, alrighty. Meet Professor Lotus at the Pokemon Poke Center. Alright, we can do that. I guess we've officially explored Trad Farm. Can we go through this way? We can. Okay, this is just the water area. I guess we can't do anything till we get surf. And I guess we still can't go down the well. Kind of a shame. Hmm. I don't know what to do there. Let's go back this way. If we if we find a cutie fly, I couch it. It's Taylor. Hmm. Hmm. Like I said, if we run into a cutie fly, if it's cutie fly, I'll catch it. If not, we're moving on. Okay, we're definitely catching this thing. I don't think I can even hit it. We're just gonna throw a pokeball. And it didn't catch. Um. Okay, it's only doing two. I'm gonna just throw another Pokeball. I don't know if I can even tackle this thing. It's catch rate's gonna be so low. Indoor. Alright, we're gonna try it. We're gonna tackle. 
Goes for the quick attack. Don't kill. Ah, crap, I knew it. I might run around here till I find another one. Let me go up here and heal. If I can. I definitely want to reel, though. That would be awesome. Steel and fighting type. I think it'd be a good start to a team. So let me run up here. Let me heal. And I may just run around. Might cut it a little bit. And, uh, until I find another Riolu. So let's go back down here. I mean, we found it in this grass, so I'm just going to stick with this grass. And I will be back whenever I find a Riolu. Alright, so we have just found another Riolu. And I have prepared because I did catch a cutie fly. So we're going to switch in cutie fly. I did not nickname the cutie fly because we are not going to use it. But I just needed something that I can damage the Riolu with. How much is this going to do? Five. Good lord. Alright, so we are going to Fairy Wind. I know it's super effective. It's not going to kill, though. Oh my gosh, it almost killed. Wow. Okay, so... Let's go for the Pokeball. Come on. I press, I press B. Okay. Come on. One, two, three. Yes! Yes, let's go. Alright, so the Cutie Fly paid off. And we call it Riolu. Now, what to name Riolu? It doesn't tell me if it's a male or a female here. That's kind of weird. Usually on the nickname screen, it, t nickname screen, it tells you if it's a male or a female. I don't really know where I'm getting these names, but I'm gonna go with Plymouth. Just kind of popped into my head, and it's kind of cool. Alright, so Plymouth the Riolu. And we will definitely add it to our party. Alright, so let's go meet the professor in the Pokemon Center right after I add it to uh, the layout. Alright, so let's go check out the Pokemon Center after we run into another Pokemon. Lillipup. I'll use Riolu once, uh, once we get healed up here. Get him trained up. If we could run back, it's still like... I don't want to say it's, it's not really lagging. I don't... I don't really know what to call it. It's just kind of like skipping frames, it feels like. It's just slow. Definitely something they need to fix, because, I mean, I can play Overwatch on my computer, so it's definitely not <laughs> my computer if it can't handle this game. Alright, so before we talk to the professor, let's heal up. Yes, yes I would. All right, so we got our team healed. Let's uh, let's go to Pokemon. We are going to switch. Oh, not summary. Get me out of the summary. Switch it for here. But I do want to go to the summary and go to the moves. Oh, to the moves, because I feel like, yeah, a new quick attack wouldn't be at the top. All right, so there we go. He's only level three. It's going to be a little rough. Let's go uh, put Cutie Fly in the PC. Put it right there. Alright, now let's talk to the professor. This is a Pokemon Center Steel. It is a safe haven in the hectic lives of trainers, as you may have realized. I left the swindler with the police moments ago, kicking and screaming. You did very well. I never would have expected you to find the thief. Your success only reaffirms my belief that you are the strongest candidate. I would like to offer the... I would like to offer you this, Pokédex. It's a tool of Pokémon researchers. I didn't even realize we didn't have the Pokédex. Still receive the Pokédex. This gadget allows you to access a trove of knowledge related to your Pokémon. After capturing a Pokémon, this information is immediately at your disposal. With that said, I have another gift for you to pair with the Pokédex. Now we get Pokéballs. Okay. These Pokéballs allow for the humane capture and training of Pokémon. With, with even a single Pokéball in hand, all wild Pokémon are potential friends. Your team can expand, grow stronger, but only as a result of strenuous training. I hope you keep that thought with you as you journey to Trinita. I wish you good luck, Steel. I wish you good luck, and I hope to see you soon, Steel. Alright, objective complete. Swindler shenanigans. Any new ones? Okay, the entire quest is complete. New quest, Trinida Teachings. Okay. 
No objective yet, though. Oh, I assume... Is this our mom? Oh, you picked Growlithe. It's precious. You chose well. I think this is our mom. Here, I got this for you. After your father agreed to pay for everything out there, and then he helped you to get your first Pokemon, so this is my little re revenge. Oh, what? The Pokey Strap. Oh. Alrighty then. It's called a Pokey Strap. It has kind all kinds of apps and functions for trainers. The tech reviews say it's essential for new trainers today. Very modern. I know Nocturne Town is old fashioned and didn't want you to look like a yokel. Yokel? I don't even know what that is. And now you're off. First you'll master turn in the university, next the world. You'll be living near your father in this exciting new place. And you'll be busy with your Pokemon, your travels. It's wonderful. But I'm never going to see you, am I? Not anymore. No, it's true. It's a very far trip and there's nothing here for you anymore. But, but mom. Oh, I knew I should have dealt with this much earlier. I'm being selfish. This was supposed to be your big day and now I ruin it with all this. Know that I'm going to miss you very much, Steel. <laughs> I'll always be home, should you need me. Sad. Alright, you can change Pokestrap apps by pressing F and use apps action by pressing V. Okay. Toggle it by... Oh, we can put it away. So, do we have... Is this my steps? Yeah, it's my steps. I, I don't know what that one is. A S D. Oh, okay. I mean, I'm going to put it away for now. Okay. So, we need to go to Trinidad? I'm not really sure where that is. I don't think it's this way. Oh, it's up where the tractor is, isn't it? Let's go check out where the tractor is. Maybe we can go that way now. Because we came from the south to get here. Man, it is really struggling. I hope they figure out something to help make that run better. I, I don't really know what else to do. Uh, route 2, okay. So, I think we're going to end it off here. Just about 20 minutes. I think our first episode was like 30 minutes, but that was the first episode. So let's end it off here. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Hopefully you guys like our new member of the team. Leave down in the comments section below if you guys are playing uh, the game. I do have a link to their Twitter. I'm sure they have the um, the, the current download link um, pinned at the top of their Twitter page. Um, I'm not going to pin the or put down the download link anymore because they keep updating it. So uh, definitely just check out their Twitter. They will for sure have it pinned there. Uh, if you guys would like to play, and if you are playing, which Pokemon are you using so far? Which starter did you pick? How far are you, etc.? Let me know down in the comment section, and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!